It's got to be here somewhere. Mom, I'll help you. The way you can help me, Amanda, is by finishing the book on Grant Harrison. Corey needs a bestseller as soon as possible. As soon as I finish my research on the Canada chapter. What do you think you're going to learn that you don't already know? I don't know, but Vicky tore the section to shreds. Ryan was not very cooperative. I mean, nobody wants to talk about what went on in that game. Can you blame them? That's it. It's not here. He's done it. He's taken it. Now, what is he up to? Mom, I, I find it very difficult to believe that Jay could just bop in here and walk off with confidence. I told you. I came in. I found him going through the things on top of my desk. And now the financial report is missing. Now, just what is he going to do with that? If he's trying to get on your good side, why would he do something like We're that? We're talking about Jake McKinnon here. That's One true. thing doesn't preclude the other. I'm sorry, Mrs. Corey. The, uh, the terrace doors were open. Oh, so that's how Jake got in here. Well, Ian, you're just going to have to beef up security around here. That better be Paulina. Hello, Corey residents. Oh, hi. Yeah, yeah, she's right here. Hold on. It's Nancy with Algama. Nancy? Nancy, calm down. Honey, just tell me what's going on. No, not... Mom. What's wrong with Graham? She's in the hospital. Nat says that her cold got so bad she couldn't breathe. But she's all right. She's going to be all right, right? She's got pneumonia. Doctors say she's had it for some time. You know, Mom, she won't admit it when she's sick. Oh, but they can treat pneumonia now. I, I'm sure she's going to pull through this just fine, Mom. Yeah. She's on a respirator. Oh, no. Nan says she really looks scared. I don't think I've ever seen Graham scared. I gotta go to her, okay? I gotta go with her. She's gonna be fine, Mom. I'm sure of it. Grandma's a really tough lady, you know? I don't think she's ever missed one day of work in her life. I know. <clears throat> this is Mrs. Corey. Would you uh, fuel the Corey jet, please, and get clearances for uh, Phoenix? I'm gonna leave in a half an hour. Thank you. No, no, I'll have Hilda do that. Why don't you just sit down? You look okay. a little pale. Well, you look scared yourself. Rachel. Oh, God. Paulina. <sighs> Rachel, I was in the middle of a production meeting. What was so important that I had to jump up and get over here? Jake has apparently stolen something, Paulina. I'm going to go call Matt. Are you going to be all right? Yeah, thanks. <sighs> all right, what has Jake done now? I was working at home today on the financial situation with Corey. I stepped out of this room for a few minutes. When I came back, Jake was in here rifling through the papers on my desk. Did he have an explanation? Yes, he was looking for the Harrison Foundation papers. But once he left, I realized that there were some very important documents of Corey's that were missing. Well, maybe he picked them up by mistake. Jake doesn't make mistakes. Oh. What he took were the financial reports, Hold it, Rachel. Paulina. Jake wouldn't just take files when you just caught him rifling through your desk. He may be a lot of things, but he's not stupid. Well, maybe he couldn't help himself. You know, not everyone is as paranoid about Jake as you are. Well, who trusts him, Paulina? Spencer? That should tell you a lot. What about Ada? She gave him the benefit of the doubt when no one else would. Yeah. She's always had a soft spot for him. Rachel, what is it? Mom is sick, Paulina. She's in the hospital with pneumonia. Rachel, I'm so sorry. I... Hey, hey, Ada's strong. She'll pull through this. Yes, I know she will. She has to. We all count on her. She's always been there for me. I couldn't have gotten through Mac... ...die without her. she's been here. I mean, she's my rock. We all need someone like that. Yeah, we all do. You know, she doesn't always tell me what I want to hear, Paulina, but she always tells me what I need to hear. I'm sorry, Iris, you're going to have to take over for me at KBAY while I'm gone. You can't sell, Iris, until we get more bids. Iris, Iris, my priority is mom right now. 
Yeah, she'll appreciate it, Brett. Thanks. You ready to go? Yes, I've called the accountants and uh, told them that we've misplaced the financial report. I've checked in with the labor attorneys about the strike, and I haven't had a chance to call Cass and Frankie about the trial, but maybe while I'm gone, you could do that for me. Oh, uh, sorry, not me. I'm going with you. Honey, you can't. Somebody's got to stay here with Allie. I'll be with Allie. I'll be staying here while you're gone. That way I can take care of my favorite niece and I'll watch security for you as well. I really appreciate that, Paulina. Rachel, it's the least I can do. Are you sure you feel okay about coming? Mom, I'm not going to miss this chance to write Grandma about goofing off. Yeah. It's impossible to fool her about being sick. And I'm going to tell her that she can't get away with pushing that thermometer right up against the light bulb like that. Yeah, well, um, come on. We've got to go. The plane's waiting. Rachel, um, yeah. please give Ada my love, okay? Yeah. I went to tell the driver to bring the car around, and I found these in the back seat. These are the financial reports, but I had them in my briefcase. I didn't leave. I'm sorry. Thank you very much for finding these. I... I'm sorry, Paulina. I shouldn't have accused Jake. It's okay. Well, at least you found them. Yeah. Listen, Paulina, would you call accounting, accounting and tell them I found this report? Absolutely. Okay. See, maybe your luck is changing, and it is too. Take care of her, okay? Yeah. Thanks. Okay. Oh, and don't worry about Allie. Oh, oh, yeah. Uh, not too many sweets. No TV after seven o'clock. And make sure she changes her leave chart after dance. Okay. Got okay. it. Bye. Give her a hug from me, okay? Jake, it's me. Pick up if you're there. All right, when you get this message, call me at Rachel's. It's very, very important. Good job. Oh, boy. She really has it, doesn't she? Yes, she does. <laughs> My mom said without jam session, she'd have a tough time selling the station. Your mother is selling KBA Law? Well? Yeah, I thought you knew. No, no, I didn't. How, how is Rachel doing? Well, she's been better. Grandma oh, has pneumonia. Oh, and Nancy oh, asked her to come and help her. Of course. Her. I am so sorry. Yeah, well, I know she'd like to hear from you. Oh, and she will. I promise you. Would you tell her that I was asking for her? And when you talk to your grandmother, please tell her the same, will you? Yes, I will. Okay. Well, I'd better rescue my date from that oh. cute college guy. Oh, come on. It hasn't been that long since you were one. I know. That's why I know what he's up to. <laughs> yeah. 